All right, Sergeant First Class Ramage, what is, up to this point in your life, the biggest hurdle you have had to overcome? Um, the biggest hurdle that I've had to overcome is also a family hurdle, and that was my son who I talked about earlier that was born with the um, genetic problem and has a lot of issues. When I was deployed in Iraq, then uh, the strain of not knowing if I was going to live and come home and things really pushed him over the edge. And with his disability, he really couldn't comprehend even what was going on. And so it pushed him into a place where something emotionally snapped in his brain and he became psychotic and really started to struggle. And he tried to commit suicide a couple of times. And it's just been one of those things where it's been almost impossible to deal with watching my son not be able to be normal and having to make hard decisions whether or not to let him live at home and put my other kids in danger or whether to put him into a facility to where they can better take care of him and protect him and the people around him. So that's probably the biggest hurdle that we've had to overcome in our life is how to deal with my son's illnesses, how to deal with him losing um, track of reality and how to best take care of him and at the same time weigh his needs with the needs of our family. Get to where I'm at, then anyone could do it. It just takes a lot of hard work. And one of the first things that you have to overcome is there are uh, levels of, of, when in the Army promotion system, you have to have time and service. Um, requirements. So at, with each rank as you move up, you have to have served as a minimum amount of time to even be able to be considered for those promotions. Along with that, then you have to have a superior or a really good um, record. So they look at everything that you've done. And the way that they measure that is what awards or uh, certificates of achievement, things of that nature that you have. You also have to be always um, increasing your civilian and military education. So there's a lot of personal time that's put into self-development, whether it be taking college classes or going to army schools. So um, to get to my level, then we invest a lot of time away from home in trying to always have that next school or that next thing that we know will push us to the next level. Um, so anyone can do it. If you're willing to put in about 15 to 20 years of your life, invest that hard be away from home a lot, um, take care of you know the Army's mission before you take care of your own needs, and then, uh, yeah, anybody can do it.